The wines that Christophe Rumier makes in his home in Chambol Musigny are like no others in Burgundy. He is a master craftsman with the Pinot Noir grape variety. And it's the texture and the aroma that he builds into this celestial grape that are quite something. Um, I pretty much year in year out buy his Bourgogne Rouge, his entry level Rumier Pinot, just a generic wine which is inexpensive and yet heavenly, drinks quite early, quite young, very plummy, has all of the wild cherry notes that you get from great Pinot. But also his Chambord Village, and then as you climb up the ladder to the Premier Cruise, he makes one of the most romantically entitled wines in the world, which is Chambord Musigny Premier Cru Les Amoureuses, the lovers. He also makes a few Grand Cru's, and Bon Mar is one of his stars. He ventures out of his village as well, uh, out of Chambord to neighbouring villages where he makes a Grand Cru Charm Chambertin, and also a uh, Premier Cru Maurice Saint Denis called Clos de la Boussière. Basically, the rule with Christophe Rumier's wines is that they are all awesome, literally. I've never been let down by a Rumier wine. Um, and they have this characteristic, this juiciness and this heavenly aroma. The oak is very under control. It's probably the most perfect introduction to the wines of the Cotonou if you're new to that sort of thing. And you'll certainly see a link between the aromatic complexity and the texture of his wines between the wines of Burgundy, where his home is, and also the wines perhaps of Oregon, or Sonoma County, or Central Otago in New Zealand. They have this unbelievable silkiness to them. So, best of luck, look out for Rumier, and I'm sure you'll fall in love with them, as I have done with Les Amoureuses.